an engineering lecturer at the Northern Regional College in Northern Ireland. I grew up on a farm and being the eldest of three daughters, I was expected to help out in the farm. I'm lucky my parents encouraged me to do jobs that could be traditionally seen as tasks for boys, like driving tractors, fixing machinery and helping my dad make things for the farm. I chose to follow a STEM related career in engineering because growing up as a child and even when I went to school, I was interested in technology and design and having that experience in the farm gave me confidence to pursue that career. Before I became a lecturer at the Northern Regional College, I worked as a mechanical design engineer in the new products group for Schrader Electronics. This role gave me a wide range of experiences using CAD software, designing new products and also prototyping them. A lot of these skills I use in my current job role as an engineering lecturer where my specialisms would be computer aided design, managing engineering projects, engineering design and engineering materials. What makes my current role exciting is my exposure to new technologies and trends as well as having an influence on the young engineers of the future. I'm very fortunate that my current job has given me lots of opportunities to travel around the world and on, on these engineering based projects I've made some fantastic connections with other professionals and different cultures. I'm passionate about getting more girls and young women interested in engineering and helping them overcome the stereotypes and barriers that are in place. I believe that for engineering to move forward we need to have a better balance of male and female colleagues so that we can design and develop products and processes to higher standards. I don't believe that the rise of women in engineering should be about the fall of men. Instead, we need to think about the unique set of skills that we have to collaborate together. Women have a great way of bringing people together and communicating and engineering is all about communicating to find solutions to problems. I believe that we need to tackle the problem at the source. We need to increase the opportunities for young women to get involved in engineering. That might be things like competitions, scholarships or work experience all of which I've been working hard at the college to support. I think it's essential to give young women a role model in STEM related careers, show them that they are capable of doing everything that men can do and encourage them to stand out from the crowd. I wouldn't be standing here where I am today if I was worried about being different. If I had the option to advise a younger version of myself and say something to the young girls to inspire them, it would be work hard, keep your head up, and remember that life is tough, but so are you. Also, don't take criticism from people you would never go to for advice.